What the hell's going on, y'all? Holy shit here. In this video, we have Mitsuko, the sorcerer class. Secure a family. Bonus between 2 to 5 heroes. 2% all the way up to 12% mana gen. I'd like to see some of these older families get adjusted so that you get uh, like the current type of perk, which is usually between 1 and 3 heroes. So that'd be nice if they adjusted all the families so that they were kind of level across the board. And she is limit broken at 810 attack, that's fairly low. 896 defense, that's also pretty low, especially for average mana speed, and 1680 HP, which is not bad. Her special skill, Mirror of Flames, deals 245 damage to the target and nearby enemies, reduces the mana of the target and nearby enemies by 20%, which is awesome. All allies reflect. All status effects and 150% damage back to the attacker and block other negative effects from enemies' ice special skills for four turns. So she is uh, somebody that you'd want to oppose ice. Sometimes Guardian Kong is like perfect against my general setup, so Mitsuko might also be good against my setup since I always seem to bring ice. Let's give her a go. There's nobody else in this Secura family, so she doesn't get any bonus. Making some ground, kind of. <clears throat> Looks like Heimdall is about to give everybody some bonus health. That's all right. Oh man. See, she's a little, she's a little squishy there. Already at five seventy seven, and I haven't even done much. Well, since she's about to go off, let's see if she ends up hitting. Yeah, let's see what ends up happening. All right, she hits up to three, so. Yeah, that, that's one of those things that's kind of disappointing. So when you think about how cool she could be on defense, she didn't even hit the two potentials that were charged up. So that kind of stinks. But now she reflects ice it, <clears throat> so I have to Either one, dispel, and if I was to hit with a lacy, I would get 115% uh, damage back to the attacker. So that would that might kill me. Let me see. Uh, let me see if I can do this first. It might not be enough to charge up Onyx. Nope. Not yet. All right. Now let's see how much damage this ice reflects back. It might kill Yoki. Yoki. Loki. Not quite. All right. Let's get some healing going on here. Oh, that almost killed her. Got to be careful there. I 
think. Oh, I forget Devana is. Uh, she dodged. She still has her <clears throat> reflection back. I think I need Heimdall to heal one more time. I need to see Mitsuko go off an additional time here. Try not to kill Heim. Well, she's about to... She's almost about to go off. So as long as she doesn't get killed. And I got two turns left for Taunt. That should be good. Oh, one more. Alright, let's see what kind of damage she does. Again, that's corner 305, 338. So, yeah, that's not enough. Now let's check to see what kind of damage is reflected back to a Lacey. Three seven nine seven eighty seven. I missed that last number. So that was quite a bit of damage back. So that's nice because everybody reflects at that point. So that's one of those things with these heroes is they hit up to three people. But I think that these heroes should at minimum hit their total of three. Just that uh, should be a guaranteed hit of three, unless there's only two, you know, left on the board here. <clears throat> Excuse me. So that's kind of disappointing. I mean, she's cool, but uh, she's a little too squishy for that much for average bonus speed. So a, there's a slim chance she's going to go off on your defense, especially with all these new heroes today. So I think overall. She's, I mean, pr pretty good to use offensively. Defensively, I think she misses the mark. Oh, yeah, she was resisting ice. So if you kind of think about, you know, all those factors, I think she still kind of misses the mark. I mean, definitely a great hero to use. I got to get some, I got to get Onyx to... He's going to reflect back, right? Yep. <clears throat> How many more turns left there? One more turn. Yeah, running out of time here. Got to be careful. Got to make sure I get that, get that win. Or try to, anyway. Yeah, so I think there's... I mean, there's a reason why you don't see her on... Uh, defense too often she just kind of misses the mark a little bit if she was a little bit more hefty then you'd probably see her a little bit more the fact that she is not consistent with her defensive hits you know that shows you how that she kind of misses the mark now if she was to hit the, the correct heroes i still think that that would have still been too weak of hits uh and it would have just dragged out the you know the defense a little bit longer so offensively i give her a solid b plus i mean that reduction of monogen of 20 percent is definitely clutch uh, as far as defensively kind of misses the mark in my opinion a little bit too squishy uh, maybe if you had five of the secure family then maybe that would bump her up that 12 percent monogen that would get her close to fast bonus speed and then I think there might not be enough uh, secure family that is good enough to, that you'd even want on defense. So 
I think she's hovering somewhere between a C plus and a borderline B minus. So let me know what you think in the comments below. I'll catch you on the next one. Later, y'all.